And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and sharing duties with me today, Stuart Robson. And everyone here on tenterhooks, you'd have to say, with good reason. How's it going to go, Stuart? Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Teo Hernandez, Jude Bellingham. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful, but timely defending when it mattered. Chuck must take the lead here. And oh, that's fantastic goalkeeping to get across and deal with the danger. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. And a goal it is! No long wait for the opener today. Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area, and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. So the game restarted by Arsenal. A wake-up call for the Arsenal players, perhaps. Can they construct a response? Oh, incredible save, and he snuffed out any sign of danger. Kaká doing the ball winning. Bremer. Modric. Virgil van Dijk. And they're moving the ball neatly enough. Just looking for that decisive pass. And teammates around him. Joao. This could level it. Corner conceded. It came off the defender. Well, he failed to get it away properly. And getting across to stop it. And look at that. A goal here for Arsenal. Who now have got themselves on terms. Well, here it is again. Cancelo's cross really does invite someone to attack it. And it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. Goal it's a lovely goal. For Arsenal. So back Number underway. Three. They've levelled it at 1-1 here. Alonso. Pelé. Will it be? And the keeper caught there. It might still be problematic. Block. Well, for power, 10 out of 10. For placement, maybe 8. The fourth and the referee has decided to add on a minimum of 5 minutes. Vinicius Jr. It. Thierry Henry, Raul. So the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this With match. The club secretary, please note Mr. Moon has left the building. Here it is now, a substitution. And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. Top-class defending. Modric. Vinicius Junior. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Over the touchline for what will be an Arsenal throw. Ronaldo. Can he put them in front? And there is the goal! He's found the net! Joy unconfined! Well, as you can see, this is absolutely brilliant. 
He's such a good runner with the ball, and it's a great individual goal. Brilliant from him. Goal. And underway Arsenal. again. Arsenal Number other nine. side in front. Pele. He has teammates around him. Oh, this could be the equaliser. Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long. And this match is level again. So the ball is running again at 2 all. Number 15. Joao Cancelo. Gavincha. Kaká. Modric. Alfonso Davies. On the attack. Is this a Ronaldo? Pivotal moment defensively. Kaká. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. Alfonso Davies. Vinicius Junior. Hulit. Must take the lead here. And a goal! This is why we adore this game. Late drama. And now they're in front. Well, here it is again. And it was never really in doubt, was it? He was always going to score from there. And they're playing again, Arsenal. and Arsenal are Number leading. 20. And the referee Vinicius decides Jr. enough is enough. It's the end of the game. Arsenal victorious. That's the main headline from this one. Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team, and they deserve their victory.